Hello, in this video today I'm going to do an experiment with salt. I've got four different salts. I've got some rock salt. I've got some ordinary table salt. I've got this Himalayan black salt. And I've got this sea salt crystals. So I'm going to just put a wash across this piece of paper. Then I'm going to drop little bits of each of these and then leave them to do their own thing. And let's see what happens if there's much difference. So I'm just going to put, I think I'll put some nice purple down. I'm just going to put it down nice and wet. Here we go. Let's do a line like this. I'm going to let it dry a little bit because you're not meant to do it when it's too wet. So I'll be back in a minute when it's at the right level of wetness or dryness. Okay, I think we're at the right stage now. So I'm going to start with the table salt. We just need a tiny bit because... Yeah. See what happens there. And now we're going to try the ordinary rock salt, which is quite chunky. So I am expecting a different result with it. Now I'm going to try the sea salt. Here's the sea salt. Very large chunks in that. And now the Himalayan black salt. It's very, very fine. In fact, it's very difficult to get single grains. I'm going to leave that and we shall come back and see what they look like. Actually, I'm going to leave it on so you can see it change. I might do a speeded up bit. Okay, so here we are. I'm going to zoom in a little bit closer so you can see the difference. So the table salt has made some beautiful stars. Love those. Now what was next? The rock salt has made bigger stars, as you kind of expect, I think, from the larger crystals. The sea salt, hmm, very similar to the table salt, isn't it? Although they're larger crystals, that's quite a surprise. And the Himalayan black salt, um, when I've managed to get the finer bits, I've got some nice, light, tiny little pieces. In fact, I shall zoom in a little bit on that. And But where I've done dollops of it, I've got larger star shapes. So I can get a variety of shapes if I use that. So there you go. That's my little experiment. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed that and I hope it's given you some ideas for different things you can try. Let me know if you've tried anything else. I'd be interested to know if other salts have different reactions. Thanks for watching. Bye.